Hi, this is John, and in this video, I'm going to be talking about a LCD stopwatch using the MSP430 Launchpad and a 16 character by two line LCD. And this application is taken from the book Programmable Microcontrollers with Applications using the MSP430 Launchpad by Mr. Unsilan and Gerhan. This is the third application I've taken from this book, and the first two applications went pretty well. This third application, uh, not so much. The hardware uh, setup and wiring was seemed solid, but when I got to the code and I tried to run it, the code just did not work. And in my opinion, the code was convoluted and apparently just flat out, uh, in my opinion, wrong. Um, since when I first started, I didn't really, since I said the code was convoluted, uh, I couldn't really figure out how to use an LCD from the code, so I just went ahead and did my own research on the internet, downloaded data sheets, looked up examples. Uh, thank goodness for the internet, and went ahead and coded and wired up the LCD in my own fashion. So I took the concept from the book using the knowledge I gained from the chapter, which is good knowledge. The chapter was great. Just the implementation of this stopwatch uh, Software-wise, in my opinion, was uh, just horrible. So speaking of not horrible application of a stopwatch, let's go ahead and see how what I came up with. Let's flip on the LCD power switch and reset the microcontroller. And for my stopwatch, I went ahead and used hundredths of a second, seconds, and minutes. I didn't use hours. I figured if you want to use hours, you know, just go ahead and use a clock. So hundreds of a second, second minutes is what I got. And the interface is very simple. You got two buttons, basically. We have our start, our stop, same button, and then our reset. And you can also start, and then if you say, oh, no, 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 I didn't really mean to start then, you just hit the reset button and it go ahead and starts in line. And this is our... Um, LCD control, which, which can make the LCD uh, brighter or dimmer. I'm not going to mess with it because it took a little while to get a, a decent picture. Um, it is a blue, a little bit harder to see even in real life. Uh, maybe next time I'll go with a green one, even though it's a little bit pricier. But this is your basic 16 character by two line LCD that, you know, there were tons of them on the internet. They're great. I recommend picking one up. This right here is our, I have this connected to a nine volt, nine volts coming in, and this is our DC regulator, We're kicking it down to five volts, that feeds the LCD. This is our trimmer pot, like I said, controls that. This hardware right here is to take down the voltage from the battery to 3.6 volts so that when I put the chip on the board, it can get power from there. But as I said before, this is a, Pretty basic implementation. The hardware is pretty simple. The wiring, um, though it's long, is fairly simple. And this is the stopwatch application. I'm John, and I hope you liked it. If you have any comments, questions, go ahead and leave them in. I'll try to get back to them if I can. Have a good one.